You left Grandpa! Daddy sent you a big present. Come here. Look! <gasps> yeah, you better open it up. Here, I'll hold your... You open it up. Is it just a book? Nope, it's a big, big present. Okay, so I think the scissors. Did I put them over there? Hold on. Good boy. What do you think it is? No. Should we open it up and see? Yeah. It's a desk. It's not. Okay, hold on. Okay, pull the flaps open. Pull these open. Pull them hard. Daddy! <laughs> Hi! Hey! Hey! <laughs> Boys and girls, can we give this hype a big round of applause? Morgan, were you surprised? Did you know anything about what's getting ready to happen? Are you excited? Thank you for all your service, what you do for our country. Thank you for being part of our chant community. And boys and girls, great job helping us make this happen today. One more round of applause for Ms. Heitman. All she does. Thank you guys so much. Welcome back. Thank you. Happy to be back to see green grass and trees. <laughs> <laughs> Morgan, you want to spend some time with mom outside the classroom? All right, come on. Simbaloo can wait. All right, I think um, I'm going to take Morgan home. For the day. Uh, if that's okay. Absolutely, it's so, okay. Morgan, get your backpack and. Get back, baby. Thank you guys for coming and supporting me. Morgan is extremely resilient. She, um, she's like I said, has been through eight deployments with my husband. She's, uh, he's been gone, starting since she was uh, three months old, um, up until uh, his last deployment. I think he got back in 2012. Um, uh, she does really well. Um, our parents help out a lot. Um, she stays with my parents for at least a month every summer in Michigan. Uh, my husband's parents help out every weekend when Eric has drill. First thing that went through my mind is she's gotten so big and she's so beautiful. And I miss her so much and I couldn't wait to give you a hug. It, it was amazing, you know, it took her a second for it to click who I was, you know. Picture these two people right at the end. Yeah. What? Okay. Did you have any idea he was going to be here? I had no idea at all. Are you happy? <laughs> but I'm so happy right now. That's all I can really, like, 
I was waiting to go see him in Korea, and the fact that he came to watch my game is incredible that he got to see me play again. Did you ever think he was up there? No. <laughs> I did. I never saw him. I never saw my dad. And that was him. I missed him so much. That was a great game. Good draw. Good draw. That was a good surprise. It worked out. Yeah. Pitch of the game, Eric the Brown. Eric Brown, right here. How are you doing, Eric? Good. You ready to take a pound? Watch for the show, okay? You tell me when it starts. How do you know when it starts? 
Hundreds of local high school seniors are preparing to graduate this week. When they do, it's likely their family and friends will be in the crowd watching. But one Mayo High School girl was pretty sure her brother wouldn't be there. You see, Sergeant Chad Clement is currently on his third tour in Iraq. But as you're about to find out, he just wasn't going to miss this very special day. For four years, Brianna Clement has spent hours in this classroom. Hours collecting the goodies and packing them up to send to local soldiers serving overseas, all as part of Operation Hometown Gratitude. My brother and uncle overseas, and I thought it, it was just really nice and important to send them packages mm -hmm. and remind them that they're still remembered and loved here. So it only seems fitting after giving so much to this project. He was all that she wanted for graduation. In this room is where her biggest graduation wish would come true. Chad! Chad! <laughs> you said you weren't coming! Hey, I had to I'm making it. I would miss that. It was a very good surprise. It was almost emotional for me. I had, to, I had to choke it back a little bit. Planning started weeks ago. Talked to my platoon sergeant and chain of command, and I, was, I admit I was hounding them. Once he told me that he could get the leave, I knew we could pull it over on Brianna. Even on my Facebook page everywhere, it said, oh, I don't think I'll be able to make it and stuff, and I just kind of accepted that. I was expecting that. Incognito. Stick me here, I'm not here, I don't exist. You had to catch him a couple times because he put a message on Facebook that he's heading home, he can't wait, the countdown's on. I was like, Chad, take that down. In the end, though, all that planning and all the hiding was worth it. To have them together is important. I'm very proud of her. That is fantastic. I love it. I, that was my one thing that I really wanted. Sergeant Clement gets 15 days of leave now. He says he'll spend that time with family, watching his sister graduate, and just enjoying being home. Then he'll head back to Iraq to finish out. So I have invited a special guest that I've been told knows this song to get it started. So if, if this guest gets it started, if you've ever heard it before, I guess maybe you can jump in and join them. Everybody get real quiet. She had to sing her since we took the floor.